Good morning. Good morning. We are in the home office, typically where we would do a top five. That is not what we're doing today. Uh -huh. uh, as you probably know by the title of the video that you clicked on. We are going to register, hopefully, for Moonlight Magic Part 2. Yay! Part 1 was at Magic Kingdom. We'll link to that right now and in the description below. So check that out if you haven't seen it. Uh -huh. This is for Hollywood Studios. Yes in March, specifically the date that we're targeting, March 20th. There's two dates that we'll be able to pick from. I don't remember what the other one is. 27th, a week later. Okay, we're trying to get the first one on the 20th. Because we actually have a resort reservation for that date. And that should be noted because we, we follow a group on Facebook that talks DVC and stuff. Maybe you're part of the same group. But we hear people talking about like getting um, a, a resort or a stay email that then takes you to the link to um, to register for these Moonlight Magic events. We never get these. I don't know why. Um, I know a lot of people don't. This yeah. is always a topic of discussion. Just so you know, we'll be doing the version where you don't have a link, where you just you know, sign on regularly, just FYI. Um, the reason we're doing this video, for those who don't know, is that the registration process for Moonlight Magic this year and probably going forward, assuming that it continues, mm -hmm. is a lot different than it has been in the past. So we wanted to show you exactly what it's like yeah. to register. Yeah, we're gonna show you step by step how to do it. So if you're going to be registering for one of these events this year and you haven't done it yet and you're wondering how, this will show you. We should note, we don't have like screen recording technology. I mean, we could get it really easily, but we don't have it right now. So we're just gonna literally film the screen of our Mac. Yeah. Just to show you how done. It's kind of like a little impromptu, you know how we do it, casual, yeah. informative, <laughs> laid back. We we're, we're gonna do this anyways, obviously, and we just thought, oh, that might be helpful for people to see. So yeah. let's do it. All right. All right. I'm on the camera. Matt's on the clicker, cause he's faster. So let's do it. So here we go. It is 8.54 a.m. Eastern. This uh, registration begins at 9 a.m. Eastern. So we have six minutes here. Well, less, five and change. So here we are, you're on the homepage of the Disney Vacation Club website. We've already logged in. That's obviously the first step you wanna do is sign in and get logged in. We see 34 days until our next vacation at Polynesian Villas and Bungalows. So 34 days, this is for the the Moonlight Magic event at yes. Hollywood Studios. We have the Polynesian Reserve. Ah, speaking of that, note this year, different than in the past, if you do not have a resort reservation, you have to wait until the date that you can register for guests without a resort reservation. That'll be in a few days, so that's different than this. That's number one. Number two, if you don't have a resort reservation, you're limited to four people in the party who can attend, including yourself. So yourself and whoever else you pick, Four total. Correct. However, if you have a resort reservation, you can register on the first date and it is for the amount of people on your reservation or up to it. Doesn't have to be that many. So if you have a grand villa with 12 people, you can register 12 people for the event. We're planning on having five. We have a deluxe studio at Polynesia that can hold five. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna click my, or you know, hover over my DVC membership and come down. <laughs> to Membership Magic in 2019. Bing! Click that. Now, if you had an email, you would have oh. a link just to click. Hey, it's hey Buzz. Buzz. <laughs> That's my guy. So we're gonna scroll down here to More Moonlight Magic in 2019 and click Read More. Mm -hmm. And this is gonna bring up all the different events, okay? So here we see Disneyland Park sold out. That one already happened. Magic Kingdom Park didn't sell out, but it already happened. Mm -hmm. I showed you the video. So now we're gonna click Hollywood Studios and you, of course, would click whatever event that you're going to do. Now, this is the page you wanna be on, okay? If you don't have the link from the email. So you see right here, it says how to register. Members with Disney Resort hotel reservations during the event can register online beginning Thursday, February 14th, 2019 at 9 a.m. Eastern time. That's today. So, oh, happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day and, and happy birthday, birthday Bandandit. Yay, it's your birthday, puppy. Happy birthday. No, oh, what did you eat, boy? <laughs> you know it's your birthday, you little ham. <laughs> Look in the camera. You're so silly. So, that's today, obviously at 9 a.m., so here in three minutes, and it does say registration opens to all members, so those without a reservation, 
in the, the 21st, so in a week. Yes. So this is where we want to be. If you see here, it says how to register. Register online when the window opens. So here, this is what we need to keep in mind now. We want to stay on this page mm -hmm. until the clock says 9 a.m. And then you want to just start refreshing the page. Yeah. Because at some point right here where it says how to register, a button will generate, it will populate that says go to page or click here to RSVP. Yeah. I don't remember exactly what it says. Yeah, and we just have to keep refreshing it and refreshing it until it appears. So that's how this works now. You hit here, click that, that's going to put you in a virtual queue and it will tell you what place you are in line. We're going to show you all of that. Then you wait to actually register. So now we wait. It is 8.58. T minus two minutes. Bandit. Wish us luck. Good luck. I hope you get into Hollywood Studios Moonlight Magic. All right. Five, four, three, two, one. 9 a.m. Refresh. Not there. So now we refresh. And this is when the page usually starts bogging down, which it is. Refresh again. Okay. The website must really be bogged down with traffic because it is not loading. I know it's not our internet. Our internet is actually really good. Yeah. But as you see, we are just kind of stuck in a thing. Um, so what we like to do is also log in on another device because last time when we registered for the Magic Kingdom one, there was an issue with the website and it kicked us out of the queue once we got through to the registration page. Oh, we got it refreshed, but still no button. So we got to keep going. Once we got to the registration page, it refreshed and kicked us out and put us back at the queue. Yeah. At the back. So then we started keeping other devices going. So at least that will hold its place in case there's any issues. Ah, still no button. Okay, this one's... Oh, it's only been a minute, I guess. But it seems like forever when you know that it's a <laughs> limited thing and you really, really want to do it. I think this one's going to be popular, though, because of Toy Story Land. Everyone's like, I need to get on Slinky Dog Dash now. Still no button. We're at 9.02. Oh, oh here we go. There's the Ooh, button. Yay! So at 9.03. Sorry, I didn't get that really good, but... Okay, it said RSVP online. It was in that same little square that we were showing you. So now you land here. So, guess ahead of you, 23.95. So we're... That's about where we've been any time we've... When we did this before. Yeah. So... About 2400 back. So now you want to stay on this page. You don't want to refresh anymore. We're done refreshing. Once you get that, stop. <laughs> now we're waiting. Now you wait. So it gives you the information. This is the virtual queue. And if you get to this, like it says here, it does not guarantee that you will register for the event or get in. And once you enter the registration form, you have five minutes to complete it. Otherwise, you get booted out and you have to re-enter the queue from the back. A couple cool things though. First of all, you'll see this update. This will change, this number. Usually large numbers at a time. It's not gonna go by one or anything like yeah. that. Typically it's more like at least 10. Also, they're gonna have updates down here. So right now it says, welcome home. Registration for Moonlight Magic at Disney's Hollywood Studios is now open. Please see your queue line number above and stay tuned for live updates throughout the booking process. As we proceed, you'll see this update. And yeah. it'll say things like, hey, you're doing great. We still have 70% availability. Keep waiting. Yeah. And then, hey, 50% still open, that kind of thing. So you'll know at least. You're not just sitting here like, where are we? I like that they update the, uh, the guests going down. Like, see, this number is smaller now. So I like that it updates that. So it kind of lets you know where you stand a little bit. And I like that it they give you notifications. So... Last time when we registered for Magic Kingdom, um, there was a glitch in the system. When we re-entered back in, it, it recognized that yes, there was a glitch in the system. We have the queue frozen right now, so nobody's moving until we fix this. And then when it was working again, they notified us and let us know that it was then working again. Unfortunately, it took quite a long time for them to give the update that things weren't working yeah. and everyone panicked. It definitely seems like they're still working out the bugs with the new system. From what we've heard from other people who have who used the old system and now have used this system, that this is an improvement, 
but they're obviously still working out some bugs just with the number of people using it. Oh, they also give you trivia going right here. Uh, kind of keeps popping up questions, so that's fun. Just yeah. something to keep you entertained. But for example, which Muppet comes out into the theater to save the penguins during the show? I'm assuming we're talking about Muppet Vision 3D? 3D! So who do you think it is? Do you know? Sweetums! Sweetums! So that's who comes out. Oh, that's the name of that guy? Yeah. Oh, I did not remember that. So we're still rolling right now. Uh, 1933. Update. So we've moved, what, about, I don't remember what we were. I think that's about 300 since we started, so. Yeah. And that, that's been about six minutes now. I went ahead and just re-entered. On my phone, I now have, I'm 3,000. Yeah. 3,020. Again, just, it's not necessary to do both, but... We like to do a, have a backup in case something happens, we get booted for whatever reason, we have something still in the queue. Yeah. We're not gonna, you can't double register or anything like no, that. No, there's no, no, no. There's no benefit, we're not cheating the system or anything here. It's literally just a backup in case something happens with this. Right, and once we get in on here, once we get in on here, we're going to close this out. You never know, too. Like, maybe your power goes out for whatever yeah. reason. I mean, it is, we do live in Florida. That happens often with storms. Luckily, it's sunny today. Your internet goes out. Internet goes out. Cell phone can obviously operate off of uh, data, assuming you have that. What if Bandit went on a rampage and ran into the desk and the computer fell off? We would have bigger fish to fry, but yeah. at least we would still get into Moonlight Magic. What kind of spacecraft do you board on Star Tours? The adventures continue. Oh, do you know the answer to this? No. I don't either. If you said the Millennium Falcon, you're wrong. <laughs> it's a Star Speeder 1000. Ooh. I would have never have thought of that. Oh, I do know this one. When was the original Star Wars film released? Oh, I think I know this too. Because you just told me yesterday. Oh, let's see if you remember. I'm going to type it so we know that I didn't just look at it. Is he right? Everyone, is he right? Yay, he's right. We had our number updated. Mm -hmm. It is continuously going down. Currently it's 1621, but we have not had a status update yet, which I think is good because that means we still got plenty. There's really still no reason to update that. I feel like it's one of those things, if you have reliable internet and you're like ready to go on the trigger at nine, it seems like you're probably gonna be pretty good. I'm assuming that Animal Kingdom's the most popular because of Pandora and because they have three events scheduled instead of two like the other yeah. ones. So I don't know what that one's gonna be like. And not to mention, that that's one of the ones later in the year, so people have time to like plan for that. It kinda seems like if you have a reservation, you're ready to go at the trigger at nine and your internet's good, it seems like you'll probably be chance. okay. Yeah. Uh, we don't know about without a reservation. I did confirm with Disney Vacation Club that <laughs> it is not total allotment open to those with reservations. And if there's any left over, you can get one without a resort right. reservation. They actually do hold a specific amount of inventory for those without reservations. So what we need to clarify here though is that if you have a, res a reservation, a resort reservation, you can miss out on the first date and still register on the second sure. date. The second date is not just for people who don't yeah. have a reservation. That's what it's intended for. Ah, we just got our first update at 9.15 a.m. So we say with 70% of Disney's Hollywood Studios Moonlight Magic registration still available, you're in great shape. Hang tight and to make your wait a bit more fun, test your Disney knowledge below. So 15 minutes in, 30% of capacity is gone. That's That definitely went faster than that. I mean, it's hard to say with Magic Kingdom because we did have that, um, what would you call it? The the technical snafu, but yeah. <laughs> but it never sold out. You could go on the next day and the day after and the day after and still register. Yeah. This is flying. This is in March. This is like prime spring break time when more people can go. You know, the one in, um, we just went to the one in Magic Kingdom. I mean, that was in February, February 12th. When, yeah. You know, kids were just getting back into school. Oh, we're in uh, triple digits, by the way. Oh, yeah. In our wait. Now, 9.49 ahead of us. True or false? Hmm. One of Woody's famous catchphrases is, 
Someone's poisoned the water hole. Please get this right. <laughs> Especially since it's for Hollywood Studios. True! True! Still going down, we're at 617 right 617. now. And it is 921. So we're 21 minutes yeah. in. We made some good progress. No updates no. on status uh, since 915. Which Disney character can count the highest? Oh, oh this is a joke. joke. Jinx. It's not <laughs> trivia. The answer, Buzz Lightyear, he can count to infinity and beyond. That fell flat. I I get the merit. Is okay, here's another joke. joke. Which Disney character won the Nobel Prize? Gaston, because he got Nobel. It has to be Gaston, right? Yeah. No, no it is. One it is. And wins the Nobel Prize like Gaston. <laughs> no one strikes out like Gaston. He won the fell off the roof prize, Gaston. <laughs> Alright, we're at 437. Oh, Still no status updates right now. Joke! Joke! Why can't you give Elsa a balloon? Oh, <laughs> come on, man. Because she'll pop it. Yeah. <laughs> what did Daisy Duck say when she bought lipstick? Oh. <laughs> I know what it is. I think this one's actually the best one. <laughs> Put it on my bill. That one's good. That one's good. I did not get that one. <laughs> oh, we have a status update Ooh. with 50%. Of Disney's Hollywood Moonlight Magic registration still available, you're in great shape. If you haven't yet tested your Disney knowledge below, now's a good time to do so. We are at 138. Wow. This has gone so much faster than the Magic King. We're halfway out. Halfway sold out. All right, we're going to film the screen from the rest of the way now because... Oh, 68! We're so close! Yep, we're in double digits now. And this is going to automatically change once we get to the... To zero, basically. So we want to show you what that'll look like. Oh, so, 10! Oh, 10. So it's going to go quick here. Neat. We can pretty much definitively say that we're in, as long as there's no bugs or anything, because we know that it just updated. Okay, see? It's That's, your turn! Thank you for waiting. You are now being redirected to the website. So don't do anything. Don't. It will automatically do it itself. At least it should. You're almost there. You will be redirected to the website as soon as possible. So just hold tight. Oh man, I'm like way too impatient for this. Well, it's especially hard for us because this is pretty much exactly the point when they had the tech issues last time. We literally got to this, it did refresh, took us to the registration page, and then it was like, oh, we have problems. Ooh, okay, ooh, ooh, ooh. so here we go. We're going to give you a quick look at this because we have to do this within five minutes, but we're not going to display our member number, obviously, for everyone. So you see it says Moonlight Magic. Hollywood Studios, this is where you enter your 12 digit member number and then confirm it. Um, and then you have to hit continue. So okay. we're gonna take a quick break while I put that in. Uh, put this in with no dashes or spaces, by the way. On your member card, it's yes. displayed with dashes, but for this, you do not use dashes. Okay, this is the next page. So basically it has the event date. It says you're eligible because we have a resort reservation. Then it has all your information listed here blah 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 then you have to check all of these statements saying that you agreed to them so we'll read those off as we go here yes. okay so i need to put this stuff in while while we're doing that phone number mm -hmm. emails already in there country residence that doesn't matter okay so you have to read and acknowledge these things disney vacation club members and their guests can enter disney's hollywood studios beginning at 7 p.m Park entry prior to 6 p.m. will require regular paid park admission. Party size limit. Member and up to the number of guests staying in their resort room accommodations or up to four people including the member. Unfortunately, walk-ins will not be available. Guests under 18 must be accompanied by a participating parent or guardian. Member must be present and attending the event. Disney Vacation Club membership card, physical or digital version on the phone and photo ID required to check in, although at Magic Kingdom the other night, they literally just looked at the photo ID. This is an open air facility. Experience and elements are subject to change or cancellation in the event of inclement weather. Check. Rain or shine, folks. This offer is part of membership extras. New purchasers after April 4th, 2016 must purchase directly from Disney to have access to membership extras. And once the event reaches full capacity, no further registrations will be accepted. Check, check, check. Continue. And we hit continue. Okay, so it says extremely limited availability. 
So now we enter our total party size, which for us is five. It says party size limit. Remember it up to the number of guests staying in the room. I'm sorry reading fast, but we're kind of timed here. So up here, party size limit. Remember it up to the number of guests staying in the resort room. Accommodations are up to four people, including the member. Unfortunately, walk-ins will not be available. Guests under 18 must be accompanied by a participating parent or guardian. Infants under three do not count towards your total party size. Please remember to include yourself in your total party size. So you and everyone coming with you in this little spot, mm -hmm. that's where you put. Then you have to check more things. We request that members cancel at least 48 hours in advance. The link to modify or cancel reservation can be found in the confirmation email received at the time of booking. Members may cancel or modify their reservation by visiting the link available in their confirmation email. Confirmation emails will come from Disney Vacation Club at mail.dvcmember.com. Please be sure to check spam filters for this message that does not appear within 24 hours. Your registration is not valid or confirmed until you have successfully completed the entire process and receive a printable confirmation page and an email confirmation. Members staying at a Walt Disney World Resort Hotel and Disney Vacation Club points or cash are not guaranteed a registration. Continue. Well, uh, we won't show you this page because of all the stuff, but it basically just says verify or edit. So you're just making sure all your information put in is correct. You mm -hmm. can edit anything. If anything looks wrong, make sure your date's correct. That's the date we want. This this event is 9.30 to 12.30 a.m. Right. Our uh, Magic Kingdom one was actually 9 to 12. So we have 30 minutes later on this one. And then boom, baby. We clicked continue and now we're registered. So we're gonna block that registration code out there. The Moonlight Magic thing here, registration confirmation. It says, Dear Hoffman family, thank you for registering for the Disney Vacation Club Moonlight Magic at Disney's Hollywood Studios. Don't forget, all the Moonlight Magic fun kicks off at 9.30 p.m., but members can enter as early as 7 p.m. Your complimentary after hours celebration will include exclusive access to many of Disney's Hollywood Studios' most popular attractions, as well as complimentary refreshments and unique entertainment. It puts your registration code here, the date, the time, tells you about the early access. Parking, it says, complimentary parking at Disney's Hollywood Studios will be available beginning at 6 p.m. You must present your member ID and a physical or digital copy of this confirmation email at the parking toll booth. Now, obviously, if you have a standard day ticket, an annual pass, mm -hmm. things like that, you can get in before this. Right. Uh, and if you have an annual pass, you have free parking. And if you're staying on site, you have free parking at the, at the parks, I'm saying. So yeah. that wouldn't matter. Mm -hmm. You do receive the complimentary meal voucher. We showed these in our Magic Kingdom Moonlight Magic video. Yeah. So be sure to check that. We'll link to it, of course, and down in the description below. And you do get one voucher for each guest in your party. So we have five people and we will get five vouchers. Yeah, so the voucher is good for one entree and one fountain beverage at the participating quick serve restaurants. Restaurants be beginning at 7 p.m. Oh, okay. 7 p.m., so two and a half hours before the party starts. I do have my confirmation email here. This gives you information on how to check in. Mm -hmm. Basically, like we said earlier, you need your membership card and photo ID. Entire party must be there to check in, so you can't have someone go and then someone come later. Early check-in will be available at the main entrance to Disney's Hollywood Studios from 12 p.m. to 7 p.m. You can check in as early as noon, but you have to have your own park ticket. To you, go in at that if point. If you're gonna be checking in at the ho or if you're gonna be checking in at Hollywood Studios that early. So you can check in at the DVC resort lobbies. Mm -hmm. That was one of the things. Now I guess you can check in at your resort if you don't have a park ticket and then, you know, go in at seven. And the event check-in at the 10 Disney Vacation Club resorts will begin at 5.30 p.m. Uh, just looking at the other information and stuff that we already talked about. Courtesy, if you're going to cancel or not show up, please let them know so other people can go. Transportation to and from Disney resorts will be provided. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. That's everything. We had success. We got in. But I'm curious to see. Oh, like how much is still left? I forgot to close out the queue. It's at 99, the one I was doing on my phones. Uh-oh, we received reports that some Twilight Zone phenomena, phenomen, phenomena? Do, phenomena, do, 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 do. phenomena, phenomena, phenomena causing mischief in our registration center. So we're taking a quick pause to make sure nothing drops out of place. <laughs> Just sit tight and please don't refresh your browser. Your number in line listed above may temporarily disappear, but will reappear momentarily. And don't worry, you won't lose your place in line during this temporary pause. Stay tuned for updates. So that was at 9:45, just two minutes ago. Yeah. So this is exactly what happened when we registered for Magic Kingdom. Mm -hmm. They encountered some technical issues and they put a pause on it. And it looks like it's been resolved because mine just changed to 88. I'm gonna get out of this though. So that's it. Yeah. It's simple, right? I mean, you just log on. Refresh, 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 refresh. There's the button. Click it. 
Wait, 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 wait. Put in your information. Check, check, check. Put in your information. Check, check, check. Confirmed. That's why we wanted to make this video in case it's you haven't done this yet and you're going to be doing it soon for your first time, maybe for Epcot, maybe for Animal Kingdom. So just to, you know, take away any stress maybe if you had, you had an idea of what it looks like. I know that helps us We yeah. have a frame of reference. Apparently there was a snafu like there was with Magic Kingdom, but ours was already done. So it didn't affect us. The system works well when it's working and it was easy and I'm really excited. I'm yes. glad we got Hopefully, yeah, like she said, this gives you an idea of how this registration process works. Hopefully it makes it a little easier for you. And if you have any questions or anything, want to know how much more it works, or you want to tell Bandit happy birthday, happy birthday, Bandit. you can leave a comment down below. Hit us up through our travel agent information at the end of all of our videos. Visit our website, HoffmanHappyTravels.com. <laughs> All that jazz that you already know. The one thing I do want you to do is if you're going to Moonlight Magic at Hollywood Studios or if you're planning on going to any of them, let us know that. But specifically, if you're going on March 20th to the Hollywood Studios one, we will be there. Yeah. We want to see you there too. Let us know if you're going to be there and maybe we'll see you around the park. Everything is magical under the moonlight. Under the moonlight. We'll be having some fun under the moonlight. We'll go on Slinky Dog <laughs> ten times. Whoa. Goals. <laughs> we hope to see you there. Let us know if you have any questions. And until next time, we will say happy travels. Happy travels. To the Twilight Wait, Zone. Wait, it's Santa's birthday. He needs to say happy travels. Happy travels. Happy puppy travels.